Alright, area two. Head to toe. Where are we? Boom, boom, boom. I think this was more of like a remix of like the... Oh. You know, co-op? Apparently not. Oh, it must have been because I went back to the main map. Uh, press buttons. Buttons pressed. There you go. Yeah, I think this one's more like a remix of a bunch of maps from the first game, I think. You know, this is like le a level in the... Or one of the episodes in the first game. Oh, right, the bullet hell guys. I love these guys. I hate these guys. <laughs> You can generally just wait and go through these things, but um, for certain ones, you can dodge their patterns, and it's really fun. At least, it's really fun if you like bullet hells like I do. Oh, should have just hit. What you can do is you go down right down the middle, and you pull on a... Uh, uh, uh. The good thing is it's not an instant kill. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, wait, wait. Um... There's a trick to the. Uh, you, I think you pull it and you shoot it. Oh, right. Alright, that's what you do. I knew there was a trick involving pulling on the sphere thingy, but. I guess I could probably give you the uh, shields for these. Whatever. Yeah, these are those. Um, well, those were the cannons I was talking about, the little mechanical cannons. Parker, what do you want? Bats are douches. Don't... Yeah, I need to save you guys. The bats reflect normal shots unless you're super close. They don't reflect missiles. Something down there. Pull the run about a diamond. Also, the water impedes your movement in a pretty cool way. The physics in this game are pretty good. They're cartoonish and all that, but... The, like way, everything Saw moves, the, way, the way everything moves makes sense, let's put it that way. Um, see, there are different skins for the cannons, which... They're kind of just palette swaps in a way, like, they have different textures and everything, too. But, I prefer having... A few enemies with palette swaps to not having any new enemy types. Like, at least it's a little bit of variety. And if you couldn't guess, the giant saw blade kills you instantly. Okay, what are you doing? He's climbing along the bottom of the couch by climbing. Let go of my sock! What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it, Parker! <laughs> I just wait for me to spawn. He'll do that where he'll like climb along the bottom of the couch by clawing. Like, he's ridiculous. I think there's something up here. Don't. Yeah. Obvious secret. That is the worst possible place for you to pop up with a dialogue box, by the way. Oh, hey, trying to shoot an enemy? Let's just put a dialogue box right over the enemy you're trying to shoot. Okay, bro. Sounds good. I mean, we didn't want to see him anyway. It's kind of ugly. What are the rewards we've been... This is the Magna Goo! Um, oh, Magna Goo. What are the rewards we've been getting for the diamonds? Like I've completely, I don't even know. <laughs> I completely phased it out. When I, I know started. the diamonds give you access to levels. Oh. Okay. Maybe that's it. Because I think we had to collect some before we unlocked the last boss. Or no, wait, that's... The... Was that diamond? I think that just happens when you clear enough ow, levels. Ow! Ow! You can grab someone out of that stuff, but if they... If their corpse touches the Magna Goo again, they usually die. Because they can still, like, if they contact something while you're dragging them along with their on fire, they'll uh, fall, or they'll die. Also, the way this stuff works is it it's attracted to your ships. 
How did that even happen? I don't know. I'm confused. Oh, well. <coughs> I, I just saw them. I heard screams and saw their bodies hit the floor. I hate when you hear screams and you don't know why and there's dead people. And, and you gotta get your shovel and goddamn it. Wait. Uh, this wasn't where they were. Fuck your shit. If you're really fast, you can kill those before they shoot off the little spikes. Yeah, it'll reach a long way, and then you just get out of its range and it'll slowly drop down. Uh, wait, you... Never mind. There's also a suit, of course, that lets you get around that stuff's bad effects. You gotta be patient around this crap. Oh god. Um, wait, stay back. I think I know what I need to do. This guy would die. And now he's got a friend. Who invited your friend? No one. Alright. Fuck your shit. You don't need to come in here. And you can activate these magnets which draw the goo. That's why it's magnet goo. It initially seems like it's alive or something, but it's just magnetic. Or maybe it's alive and magnetic, who knows. It's alive! Possible obvious secret? Nope, we're just dead. Well, shit! Well, now we know. Yeah. That would have been a great place to hide a secret, but whatever. You can also shoot down the spikes that those guys fire, but it's not a very surefire way to do that. And that stuff is not an insta-kill, but it does kill you very quickly. <laughs> oh yeah, and you can just not fire on these guys. Okay, let's not try to be a hero this time. Except for all the parts where we save people and stuff. I guess it's kind of heroic too. No dodging necessary. Wait, hang on. Let's check the bottom. It's probably not going to be no. too obvious. Like all. Water cannons. These are fun. Go, go, cannon! It basically shoots a water fruit. Oh. <laughs> Excuse me. Ow. Ow. No! Don't die. What did I just say? Didn't know it fully hurt me like that. If you don't, uh... Damn. If you don't kill them quick enough, they'll uh, snap back and you'll have to grab, them, grab the sphere out again.
It's generally best to just use your damn missile on those, because they're a real pain if you're up close and not murdering them. There we go. Now the next water cannon shot. Erase that lava. Uh, not in time to save me. You could have picked me up. Go! <laughs> Help! <laughs> yeah, you got us. We kind of destroyed everything. We're evil. Yep. Oh, time to kill everyone now. They know too much. Yeah, maybe we're that guy. You can't go up those. Just water goes through them. Such a tease. Cool. Water in any liquid, actually. There we go. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> I, thought you had, I thought for a second you had lived. I was about to be like, oh, that was lucky. Nope. Death. Just death. I think it was still firing as I spam, spam so that's why I got hit. Diverting lava is fun, but rarely actually useful. Though sometimes you can knock lava onto enemies, which is very fun. Like that. Um, bro. Bro! Rest in peace. Aw, oh, you- I would've hit the lava, it worked for that. Oh well. Learning experiences. Oh, right. Fuck your shit. Sometimes you want to leave the goo alone so it'll flow down. Because sometimes if you're close to it, it'll get stuck. Like that? Yeah. Because it'll. It's got a pretty strong attraction to you. It's pretty anti if you know what I mean. Why can't more women do like this goo? Incredibly dangerous. Could use a little danger in my life. Okay. What does this stuff do to... What does water do to that stuff? Alright, oh, turns into toxic gas. I think we wanna... Uh, I have no idea if this is a good idea. But I did it! Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Yeah, I did. I assume that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah, we can get out, we can get out. Uh oh. Water plant, go! Oh, yes. That is the spot. Uh oh. Uh, wait for me to respawn, because this is risky. Alright. Uh, needed to be closer. I'll do it. Oh. Excuse me, Lava. you know that gas never hit the lava. Oh, yeah, the gas explodes when it hits the lava. Five more treasure. <laughs>